It's a breeze bait. Everybody. Welcome to our 12th episode of the 25 Days of Wheel for this year. Eve the Cool Dog 7 won $129,600 last night and brought our jackpot to $2,042,300. We'd only had $1 million winners so far this year. We'd like to make it two. Let's see if we can. What? I have. So basically, the structure of the film is basically just a bunch of music videos coming together into a feature light. Hi, how's everybody doing? Here we go. That is toss up our first puzzle of the night. The category is Thing. Thing. Got it? Go ahead. I think I thought of for a second. What was the category? Thing. Okay. Okay. Brilliant lights. I have no idea. Get ready. We're going to do another toss up. This is a $2,000 puzzle. For our next puzzle, the category is fictional characters. Fictional characters. We'll get it started right now. Jolly Old St. Nick. Don't we all? Well, I know the number one person is on the naughty list. Number one is Lord Dempnut, aka Donald Trump. Lord Dempnut, yeah. Lord Dempnut is actually an anagram for Donald Trump. Yeah, I learned that from Eugene. Oh, Harvey Weinstein? Yeah, he's on the naughty list too. You got it. So, how is it possible that Hollywood is now simply allowing that power to be I don't know. It's beyond me. Oh, yeah. Let's have yes, there is on B. Oh, one too many. Oh, Snoopy Stacks. Oh, 
Scooby Snacks and Yippie Kaye medium fries. Yeah, that's why I said Yippie Kaye medium fries. Yeah. And for those of you who want, and for those of you out there watching who want to know what the real quote is, watch the movie Die Hard and find out for yourselves. Exactly. Right. Or you can't watch it on your own until you're at least seventeen. Now what? You short. The curse of the bankrupt strikes again. You have failed. And I hope you fail too, Player 3. And it's the curse of the bank group for Player 3. <laughs> Sorry, Player 3. You also have failed. One more spin, I'll get it. Oh, yeah. Driving test. Player one is going to solve. Let's see if it Congratulations, well done. House minimum of one thousand dollars, so we'll give you that. Everybody's doing well, but who will go to the bonus round? We'll find we out after us. this. Us, of course. Welcome to the mystery round. The category for this one is landmark. All right. And player two is all set to go. Oh, I know the solution. And if it's my turn, if I land on the million, I know which letter to call and I'm going to solve. But I have to land on the million first. Sorry, if it's a computer player, he lands on it. <laughs> Lee, I was telling the audience when Pat gives away the money. Remember, it's my show. I I have to inform the audience of that as well. Okay, that's fine. There must be some M. 
How many? <laughs> Mystery Wedge, but I'm gonna take the money. We'll see if you're again or in a minute. The Alamo in San Antonio, Texas. This would be a bit of a gamble, but there uh, could be ten thousand dollars uh, under this. Layer one is going to take the. I actually down. don't know. Layer one is going to try to solve the puzzle. I've never been to San Antonio. Yeah, precisely. I'll do some research on it later on. All right. All right, player one. You want a nice chunk of change with that solve? We'll be back after this. Movie title is the category for this next round. And it's a prize puzzle. Here's that magical sound. And our first spinner will be player three. This could be good for you. Oh my god! Ha <laughs> ha, you fail! Oh, okay. Oh, I know the solution, but I'm gonna keep going. Well, no million dollars tonight, unfortunately. But we tried. Three hundred. Yes. And we have one out of continents. Ratatouille. <laughs> You've got a solution to change here. Let's see how it goes. Yes, it is. It's a trip to Paris, France. Let's not forget, this was also a prize puzzle. What do we have, Jim? Uncover the city's wonders of Paris. Take a cruise down the Seine, get your photo at the Eiffel Tower, and take in the masterpieces at the Louvre. $9,000! Not only did you win some cash, but you also picked up a prize along the way. Congratulations! We'd like these totals to grow, and hopefully they will, right after this. All right, it's toss-up time again. $3,000. <laughs> It's Thing this time. Thing. Let's go, Vanna. And play the one. Docking station. Nice going. Congratulations. Docking station. That was the puzzle. Okay, one. Since you won the last toss-up, you'll be starting. For our next puzzle, the category is Phrase. Player one, your turn to start. Could be trouble. Nice one. Um, N. Yes, there is N. One N and it's worth $5,000. It's my turn to spin. I'll ask you to give me a letter. If it's in the puzzle, you'll have 15 seconds to solve it. Vowels worth nothing. Consonants worth $1,000 plus... $400. Player one, we start with you. Oh, there must be some S's. I'll make it.
player two. And you know what? There's none of those. Sorry. Oh, oh. sorry. Yes, there is and fell. Supreme. Supreme. That was tough. Solve the last puzzle. Congratulations. But I still went with 22,300, so that's okay. Third place. But you still play quite well. You're the big winner. Bonus round for you. Might as well get some more money. Spin that wheel. The first A in America's. Here's the prize envelope now. It's thing this time. R S T L N E. Are there any of those up there, Ben? Okay, we need P H C A. A sharp pencil. The New Orleans stage. Oh well. Fifty-two thousand three hundred dollars tonight. Let's put it in the jackpot. Two million ninety-four thousand six hundred so far. Here's how you did. And now we pick a winner. is our winner. So congratulations Cameron, you got $52,300 and our jackpot's now at $2,094,600. That's going to do it for our 12th episode. Tomorrow night we'll be at our half point on the 25 Days of Wheel and we'll see if we can give away more. See y'all tomorrow night everybody.